Hey yo, ten shots, six blunts blowing through the session. Dragging on a split, free and dragging on a clip. A MC in a booth, an assassin on the roof. I'm just waiting to shoot. Make it hurry up and die. Uh, Greatest chunk of spears. You would think you had drama. Ladies and gentlemen, what's really good? Y'all already know who it is. Geraldo Chef, Muffins Martinez, the greatest MLW podcast, let me say fan podcast ever, because we give you everything. We got the insight. Listen, there's no one that has their ears to, to the streets like we do. We hear everything. We bang out with a lot of the talents. So, well, you know, we love this shit. This is what we, we enjoy talking. What I will say, and this is just my opinion of why it would work. Uh, we all know that Santana, formerly of LAX from Impact Wrestling, and as of the moment, uh, I guess pride and powerful, but we don't know anything besides him being hurt and Jericho kind of talking about when his contract was coming to an end. But um, if he decides to walk from AEW, I don't think there's a better spot than MLW. Obviously, if he went to Impact Wrestling, he has ties there. He'd be great there if he went to WWE. I don't know where he fits in there because it's WWE. Even though it has new management, we haven't seen much change to what they've been doing. And we have to give it time. But if you look at the landscape of what MLW does and with how ethnic it is, I think he's the perfect fit and he could easily go into the, either the open weights heavyweight Santana is one of the best wrestlers I think in the game today. And I would love to see him in MLW when that contract expires. On you, my brother. You good. We talking some Santana or are we sleeping? Yeah. Okay. No, I'm listening, but you 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 know you can make your notes. I wasn't sure you like behind Echo Tall. I'll make sure that you did it for dumb. But yeah, I mean Santana, man, you know the 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 rumors are rampant between him and Ortiz. You know everything is on the dirt sheets. Everything's going on. Nobody knows what's going on there. I mean now he's definitely hurt. He's definitely gonna be out for maybe the remainder of the year uh, with whatever knee issues. You know ACL. PCL, so that's definitely going to take some time. Um, he'll definitely fit if, if it's true that the two guys had run. He'll definitely be a phenomenal singles wrestler. NWA, Impact Wrestling, MLW. He could fit in there, man. He could definitely fly. He could definitely do his thing on his own. Uh, he's been doing his thing on his own for a while before. The injury happened. I mean, he had just won the title down in Puerto Rico uh, yep. for another company there. Uh, so he had to go down and relinquish the title recently because of the injury. So so that's got to suck for him. Uh, but, man, once he comes back full strength, man, hopefully his contract is almost up with AEW and he's able to go and negotiate and, and do whatever he wants to do anywhere else, man. But hopefully he'll come to MLW. But any of the small, you know, smaller three companies will definitely love to have them there. And, and, and like I said, whatever division, you know, next division or heavyweight, he'll be fit anywhere. And, and I think that um, with how he is, I think he fits perfectly with MLW. It's not even a question because if you look at his body of work, if you look at his style, and then you look at the landscape of how MLW has transitioned over the last year. He fits in absolutely perfect with MLW is doing. Am I being biased? A million percent. But I did lead off with he would make perfect sense going back, going back to Impact Wrestling because that's where he got that big start from. Everyone's, you know, they were the hottest tag team in the game. Everyone knows it's not a secret. Yeah. But singles wise, I think he could do so much more in MLW and have creative to let his own thing happen the way he wants to happen. And I think he would murder it. Yeah, for sure. I mean, uh, of course, we'll, we always say MLW now, but, you know, he could go back to Impact Wrestling. I hope not. I mean, there's, I don't know, there's so much weird stuff going on there anyways. Uh, he'll definitely fit in the NWA. 
I mean, especially now that, that uh, Billy Corgan had a fallout with uh, uh, Magnus there. So, you know, right oh, now, wow, in know whatever that. face he is. Yeah, yeah. Recently, they had a fallout. I guess too much politicking behind closed doors. I guess finally got to Billy Corgan and he just couldn't take it anymore to the point that he actually removed uh, Magnus from the main event at Andy Ray uh, 74. Just because oh. he just got fed away with the politician behind the doors. So so he removed them and now put Tyrus in the title match against Murdoch. So so pretty oh, like, Jesus some stuff he, either, yeah, he, yeah. Yeah, either it's a work. I don't know. I, I know Corgan was at the both the open show uh last week and he just got fed up and he just and I and actually I believe Corgan because I, I don't see why he sh- he got to lie about stuff like that. But I believe in what he said. You know, he just got fed up with it. And then this week, uh, Magnus went in, told his side of the story about how he's been working for free for the last two years when COVID was thing and how he defended the title all the places without him getting paid, blah, 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 blah. So, so they, definitely, they definitely got personal there in the last two weeks where... where uh, each other's story, so you know. So right now, I mean, they're definitely lacking a, a nice baby face. So he will definitely fit there in the future if that's the truth between him and Magnus having the fallout. So you you know what? <clears throat> Jeez, that's crazy. <laughs> I don't even know what to say to that. But um, yeah, listen, yeah, bro. Everything, it, you know, everything is politics, man. Everything is politics. Yeah. You know. You 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 want to be the face of the company, which he has. You want to be in every main event. They they want to change stuff because they want to give us fans different stories. But you know when you've been doing stuff, you want to be the guy. You know, and there's so much of us we could take of watching the same matches all the single time. You know, push yeah. someone else. So you know. You know what. Before we dive too too crazy on that, I think the the internet's been a little bugged out. But for myself, the big homie, we out of here, deuces.